family. Once again, it's your DC dude. If you are already a subscriber to this channel, then welcome back. However, if you are new to this channel, I recommend that you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can stay and know about where we're gonna go. So it's actually pretty cold out here as you can see, but I had to do the spur of the moment video family. Now, I'm probably late with this information. I understand this has been here for a few months, but I just noticed it, right? So you can actually see it from Rhode Island Avenue as you're passing by. And behind me is Foreman Mills. So it's right in the same shopping center as that. But you can also see behind me, there's a lot of development. I got here, I don't know if you can see the subway down there. That's the, that's the uh, Rhode Island Avenue subway. I was on my bicycle on the bike trail and I was like, what, 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 what in the world is this? I don't know if you've ever heard of a draft house, but I used to go to a draft house all the time. It's been around for a very long time in Arlington, Virginia called the Arlington Draft House on Columbia Pike. Now I have good memories there because you actually, it's, it's a better movie environment where they have a restaurant and a bar inside. also nine movie theaters. Now, they, they, they're on two floors. They have four theaters on the first floor and five theaters on the, uh, on the second floor, right? And their largest theater is called The Big Show. And that has the largest screen in D.C. next to the IMAX in the Smithsonian Institute, right? But it also seats 215 people. So family, having a, a brand new movie theater in the Northeast area in DC is refreshing. Growing up for me in the 1970s and 80s, we stayed, we spent all day at movie theaters like the Senator and the Highland east of the river. I'm sure, I'm sure you all have stories about the movie theaters that you went to in your neighborhood. It was extremely refreshing to see the, the return of the movie theaters. Now they have some, they still have some scattered around the city, but it's nothing like it used to be. One more thing about this draft house that actually is the same as the draft house that I mentioned earlier in Arlington. They show old movies. Now, I don't know if they sometimes show new movies, I didn't get that information, but what I did find out that every single movie they have right now is a throwback. And they did a Harry Potter thing over the weekend. Um, so they these are throwback movies. But like I said, the environment is pretty cool. So family, we're gonna end it right here. And as always, you never know where we're gonna end up next. So if you wanna ride, just click on subscribe.